dollar, dollar, dollar. Dirt and money, no soul. Had to go and get it, ain't no time to kick it. Got a stack of flip for my foes. Dollar, 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 dollar. Please tell me you can hear me. Don't turn your back and don't neglect me. Just let me know if you need me. Dollar, 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 dollar. Let me watch out for my partners. Keep my money long, get my team strong. Let me run away from my problems. Yo, what's good, original crew? It's your boy DJ Nuki, your girl. Sierra Nicole. Back on the channel was a guy we haven't brought on the channel in a long. Mm -hmm. I mean, a long. It's been a I mean, a long time now. Mm -hmm. We got the boy Bill Burr back on the channel, man, with crazy homeless people. people. I don't know what this can be about, man. You, 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 now I, I heard about the homeless people in, in, in LA. Now mm -hmm. I heard, I, I hear they they look crazy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> well, I don't like I don't like to talk about homeless people because you know yeah. everybody some everybody sometimes get on they get, get down, down and they look. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So it's just because you you in that position now don't mean you can be you'll be in that position all the time. So forever, yeah. Yeah, I don't like oh, but you know what I'm saying? Sometimes you come. Have you ever, you ever volunteered at a homeless shelter? Mm. Like at a homeless homeless shelter. Mm -mm. I volunteered at a homeless shelter and a women's shelter, mm. which is to two is totally different. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like the energy is very different mm -hmm. in both. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Homeless shelters kind of you know what I'm saying? It's it's a, it's a whole different vibe. The I say the women's shelter just felt way more gloomy mm. because it was like a women abuse shelter. Yeah. So you know. Yeah. So, with all being said, welcome back, Bill. Make sure y'all check him back. Yeah. Check out the links in the description box. Down below. You already know where to go, man. You want the first part, you got to do a check out down below. Also, yes. if you enjoyed today's video, as always. Like it then with a thumbs up. Yeah. All right. So, let's go. <laughs> let's check it out. Let's see what it's about, man. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. I'm trying to be, I don't know, trying to be a better person during all of this shit, you know? I am. Do you know I, uh, I got this new thing, man. I try to help out homeless people. You know? I used to, you know, sometimes I help them out, sometimes I don't. You know, it's like the mood you're in, how much they freak you out, you know? So, this is what I do. This is how I'm, I, you know, you gotta do something because I don't know, people at the top don't seem to be doing anything. I try to bring all my old clothes down to the 10 cities to give it to them, all right? Okay, it's a good okay. thing to do, but I gotta tell you something, you gotta do it during the day, all right? <laughs> you wanna do it during the day when they're tired from Thunderdome the night before, they're coming down from whatever they're on, realizing hey. there's a nail in their shoulder. You wanna get them when they're tired. You don't go at night. No one's gonna see you again. You're gonna end up on a fucking spit. I mean, it's, you're under an overpass. You never know what can happen, okay? Fact. I'm just warning you, because they don't make homeless people the way they made them when I was a kid. You know? <laughs> when I was a kid, a homeless guy was a bum, he was a vagrant, somebody down on his luck or whatever, you know, a wino. They didn't have this Shutter Island <laughs> going on that they had out there, like people talking to trees. <laughs> I'm not gonna play with Bill on this one, though, bro. I'm not, because this is a sensitive talk subject, bro. No, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. But, yo, I ain't gonna count. Like, downtown Nashville, I, don't, I ain't been downtown in a minute, though. Mm. But, she, they, the way they used to linger out, that's the reason why they came out with the law mm -hmm. here. Hey, if y'all don't know, in Tennessee, it's, it's, uh, it's against the law to sleep on the street now. So, as for homeless people, if they get caught sleeping on the street, they can get locked up and charged with a felony, right? It's something like that. I just think that is so terrible. But but they, because downtown Nashville used to go downtown, and them motherfuckers used to be sleeping on the lawn of the... Yeah. But I'm like, they like, hey, do something about the homeless community, yeah. because really ain't no shelters and stuff around. Right. So, mm, it's crazy, bro. One that they had out there, like people talking to trees. I first got <laughs> You're like right here having like eggs bended in. It's like looking. What you thought of myself? The 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 joint that just popped up. The old lady. Who? The old lady to be at the ramp. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we was like, bro, when she pop up, remember that one day? Yeah. Her dude was coming to pick her up in that Impala, Yo. and he had the blinkers on slowing down. And we like, bro, it's traffic, bro. Go. I was like, where is he going? I and then said, we passed I by, and I said, I said, he's 
about to pick her up. I said, he picking up, picking her up. Mm -hmm. I said, bro, are you serious? But Unless they maybe sleep in a car or something. To be real, it ain't look like it, though. No, I don't think it so. It ain't look like it, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A porthole over your cabbage? <laughs> yeah. When I was a kid, you could only be crazy outside for about 15 minutes before a van would pull up and two guys in nurses' outfits would just come walking out. Hey, buddy, how's it going? You're making a lot of racket out here, aren't you? Why don't you do me a favor? Try this shirt on. And you're like, okay. How come the sleeves are so long? Oh, because we're going to tie your arm behind your back because you're out of your f***ing mind. That's it. I'm going to have you out here scaring the And you got in the van, and that was it. They send you to a nut house. That's it. Boom, bam, done. Nut house. But the problem was, was the people at the nut houses started f***ing the patients because everybody knows crazy people are great in bed, right? So they're banging them. You know what that made me think. Oh, no. <laughs> Please don't say it. Please don't say it. I'm not. Please don't say it. I I'm not going to say that one. I'm not going to say it because that's a crap. Bruh, the fact that this he's going off for real, bro. Yes. He's like, you know he said people, crazy people got some of the best. You know people personally that's on... I'm like, what was you thinking? Bro, that's... Why? I thought about it, but I ain't want to focus on it because I said, bro, that is fucked up, bro. That's messed yeah. up, bro. And you know, it happens a lot. I started f***ing the patients because everybody knows crazy people are great in bed, right? So they're banging away. Hey, it happened. You're groaning history. All right? You can shake your heads all you want, all right? But the, hey, <coughs> hey. <laughs> they <laughs> those people, all right? And they were banging away, doctors with their lab coats, slapping in the wind, just banging away until finally, for decades, finally somebody with a heart came walking in like, ah, what the is going on there? <laughs> and then they shut it down. And then they just let all these people go. They all came running out like Mike Myers jumping up on station wagons. <laughs> so that's the thing. You go during the day. And I gotta tell you, when I pull up to one of these ten cities, I always feel good about myself. I'm just good, man. Helping out a fellow American, I would want them to do that for me. It's ridiculous people have to live like that that's what i think when i'm in the car and then okay. the second i get out and that smell hits me i'm like what the f am i doing <laughs> jesus christ Sorry. these people are animals right oh. i would equate it to the same feeling you probably get if you were on a safari and you're in the land rover and you look over and you see like a leopard you're like yeah look at that leopard over there ah, right then all of a sudden you go over a bump and you fall out of the <laughs> range like, oh, that's a leopard Yeah, so I pull up and I'm feeling like, you know, fucking Uncle Sam. And then I get out of the car. I'm just like, Jesus Christ, what the f am I doing? I start walking like this. There's always like some sort of movement going on. Somebody fucking limping across the street or something. And I've never been able to get close enough to talk really to anybody. You know, like they do on the news. You know, like, Jesus, you've been sitting in here, you know, for a couple of months. What is it like to be inside of this tent? I always wondered how many people they had to choke out before they could get that interview. You know? Just coming in, blow darts. Dumbing up everybody else. Building a perimeter. So what, what, I, what I do is I get about 30 yards away and then I, I just start, I start walking like this. And I chicken out. I was chicken out 30 yards away. I just wanted to go, free shirts! <laughs> I'm back to the car. And that's when your brain starts playing tricks on you. Like I'm convinced somebody just came running out of that tent with like a two by four. <laughs> running after me. So what I always do is I always do a lap around my car before I get in it, you know? Because homeless people have horrible <laughs> lateral movements. I'm not about to play with him. I'm not. Bro, I'm bro. I'm not. And it just, it brings back all the memories uh, that I had when I was at the homeless shelter, bro. Like, I ain't, bro, some, some, some people in there joining crazy for real, though. Like, like you be like, bro, they need some help, bro. What did you do 
also have to understand, not all, but some do be up, like on like medication. Dr- well, medications or drugs and stuff like mm-hmm. that. So you do have to like think about that. They be, too. They not be everyone. In some the one people that, just the one I know, worked at. They they help them with their medications. Follow so. hard times. Oh, yeah, yeah. And some people just fall on hard times, but everybody the, uh, ain't like on medication they, and drugs and Because the one I went to, stuff. they actually had like an area where, you know, I'll, I'll talk about it. Yeah. Then. My bad. Running after me. So what I always do is I always do a lap around my car before I get in it, you know? Because homeless people have horrible lateral movement. You know, from all those years of sleeping on the sidewalk, their hips are just jump, you know, like an NFL running back. They gotta slow down like a cruise ship, like go right up and over the horizon. So in that time, you, you go around your car, you get your car, you drive away. You drive away. Your closet's a little more empty. You go out, you can fill it back up again. <laughs> you don't fucking need, you know, that's, what's, that's what you do. America. What's that, sir? America. America, yeah, America, don't think. America. Just do what you wanna do. Take your dick. I'll tell you, that's what George Washington was talking about. Bro, yeah? like ain't no homeless people in They the really need the to shut down the internet. They, they have to shut them here. Clearly too yeah. stupid to all be sharing ideas in this giant county bar that we've created. I said it's oh, You guys are all cheering. You're all on the internet just like me. <laughs> I was on the internet for six hours last night. Bro, he said the same shit I always be saying, bro. Hey, we got to do so, bro, because everybody ain't, should not be allowed to... Uh, be on the internet. Uh, trying to put their opinions in a two cents. No. No. But I'll say this. The homeless the homeless shelter, I did, uh, like, volunteer uh, when I was younger. Was it here? Oh, no, 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 no. It was when I used to go on, like, mission trips and stuff. Oh, okay, yeah. So, uh... It was one and it legit it had a uh it had like a like the, a kids play area. And yeah. I was like I was like, Y'all got a kids play area? Yeah. And I went like as the day started getting like later in the day, mm-hmm. when the family started coming in, like trying to get uh food and stuff. 'Cause I went I went to the back. At one point I was helping in the back mm-hmm. where they had all the clothes and stuff. And there was a lot of clothes in there, but we were putting like the shampoo in a in a little bottle so yeah. they could be able to hand out individual soap and shampoo yeah. to people. But it was like one family in there legit it was the dad, the mom and a little daughter. And I was like, damn yeah. And they fell on hard times because the dad had lost his job yeah. and couldn't bounce back. And, it happens. And, like, I was like, damn. But she was so happy. And I was like, the fact that some of these people sometimes, especially in those situations, be some of the happiest because they still are together. Yeah, and you have to understand that, like, a lot of things for other people is materialistic. Yeah. So, like, as long as I got my family, I got my health, like, yeah. I'm still breathing. Like that's all that matters at the end of the day. Matter of fact, I went to another shelter. I went out sort of. The, I have been to multiple shelters. Mm-hmm. The shelter I'm talking about, I did like we was we was down there for a couple of days, but we were doing so much, so we wasn't. But I went to, we went to that shelter twice, and that was when I was uh, in Oklahoma. Went to Tulsa, and it was mm-hmm. a shelter in Oklahoma. In uh, Oklahoma, it was Tulsa uh, Broken Arrow area. Uh, but I also went to a homeless shelter in the Dallas area. Okay, you just don't been around the world, honey. I used to. I used to travel. I used to get out there. Missionary. No. To be real, it was I, a mission. It was I missionary. don't consider like I. But that's what they, it was. That's what they called it. They, you was on. Tell me what the, when you went with. Uh, mm-hmm. I I don't look at it because I, I don't I personally I don't like when people do like mission trips because yeah. some of those be scams and it be yeah a lot money. of a lot yeah I don't mess with that um, I had a woman approach me um, one time when I worked the last uh, well when I was back home when I worked at the clothing mm-hmm. store and she approached me and she was like she said I just been watching how you've been interacting with everyone and da 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 da, da and you seem so genuine and so sweet and, mm-hmm. da, da, and she had like gave me like this pamphlet and this card and she was like yeah. telling me about all this stuff and it's just I don't know for me personally it just didn't come off like mm-hmm. like what is like what are you guys actually doing like you know because a lot a lot of it do be scammed for monetary gain mm-hmm. and I just don't and I I I, 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 I say this straight up like with ours it was never for monetary gain yeah. bro we we roughed it out. 
Man, when I said we slept on floors wherever yeah. they allowed us to sleep at, yeah. we uh wherever y'all like people gave us like whether a sink or a shower to like shower, we we got it like we got it out the mud. Like yeah. you just like long as you got a comforter, you can put. You know what I'm saying? We that's how we like we slept in on gym floors. Yeah, like on on the floor floor or in like a, like y'all had a couple like office rooms we could sleep in for the night. That's how we got it. But I think our goal wasn't, you know what I'm saying, it was to help the community and, like, to be real, because we was young, we was teenagers, mm -hmm. but we would, like, our energy was always on yeah. on a level to inspire others to want to. And so we used to have people in the community be like, hey, where y'all going to be at tomorrow? We trying to be where y'all at. Yeah. We, like, we tell them, hey, we going here tomorrow. Like, y'all, they were like, oh, yeah, we Bet we there. How long y'all here for? We here for a week. I guess it oh, depends yeah, on where bet. you go and what you're doing. Because, you know, I told you my hairstylist, her um, daughters just went on a mission trip. And they mm -hmm. went, like, out of the country. And she was telling me how, like, when they came back and they was telling her, like, all about, like, what happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, like, the people weren't really messing with them. They like, why y'all here? We didn't ask Because I said this. Ours, ours wasn't necessarily about just being so biblical. Yeah. But it was about helping out the community yeah and that's what theirs was about yeah, it was yeah. about like you know they was like doing stuff in the community painting fences cleaning oh, we went, up we and went stuff doing like stuff that. like that yeah, like, yeah. i'll say this when we went to the shelters that's what we did ours yeah like when with even at the uh women's the women's shelter mm -hmm. they did a lot of women to be there because of you know yeah because like you didn't domestic know who, violence yeah, yeah, and stuff like so, that yeah, most but we cut their grass painted did things that Basically, the men, because we want number of men. Yeah. All the boys and yeah. men, we went out there. We ain't let, you know what I'm saying? We just, they're all completely outside work for them. But, um. Sorry, y'all. Sorry for the small story time, <laughs> sorry, bro. Sorry, sorry, Uh, but, hey, man. Bill. <laughs> I, I get what he's saying, though. Yeah, I get yeah. what he's saying, because he can't be a scary side, man. But make sure y'all spend what's <laughs> up. Let us know y'all thoughts in the piece. Please do. In the comment section down below, man. But, as always, y'all know how it go, man. I do go over the name DJ New Kid. This is New York. We are your cool. Ain't no time to kick it. Got a stack of flip for my folks. Dollar, 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 dollar. Please tell me you can hear me. Don't turn your back and don't declare me. Just let me know if you need me. Dollar, 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 dollar. Let me watch out for my promise. Keep my money long. Get my team strong. Let me run away from my promise.